Hello kids, welcome to today's maths class and today we'll do multiplication. Let's revisit. Look at the multiplication shown on the number line and fill in the boxes. So, here, 2, 2 ke jump hai, kitne times? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 means 7 times 2. That means 7 into 2 that means that is 14. So 7 times 2 means 7 into 2 that is 14. Next is multiplication. Repeated addition means adding the series on same number. Multiplication is the short way for repeated addition. Remember, the answer of the multiplication sum is called product. Multiplication ka answer kya kya hai? Product. Next, multiplication on number line. We can also perform multiplication on the number line using repeated addition. For example, multiply 4 by 3. So, start at 0, take 3 jumps of 4 steps. 3 step every time we are jumping 4 steps. So, we will reach to number 12. That means 4 plus 4 plus 4, 3 times 4 add karenge, that is 12 or 3 into 4 that is 12. So, 3 jump of 4 that is equals to 12. Next is practice corner 6.1. Multiply using number line, also write the multiplication statement. Multiply 3 by 5. So, start from number 0 and move to number 3 5 times. 1 time, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So, we will reach number 15. So, 5 jumps of 3. That means 5 into 3, that means 15. So, this way we will multiply numbers on number line. Next, multiplication table. We have already learned the table of 2 to 10 in our previous class. Let us quickly read them aloud and revise them. So, here the table of 2 up to 10 is given. 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4, 2 3s are 6, 2 4s are 8, 2 5s are 10, 2 6s are 12, 2 7s are 14, 2 8s are 16, 2 9s are 18, 2 10s are 20. Like this, we can make table up to number 10. Like 3 kia to 3 into 1, then 3 into 2. Like this will keep multiplying and can make the table. So, you have to revise all these tables from number 2 to 10. This is very important for multiplication. Next is multiplication method. There are 4 baskets. Each basket have 5 apples. How many apples are there in all? Total number of baskets, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4 and in each basket there are 5 apples. So, 5 into 4 that is 20. This is the vertical method or we can write 4 into 5 that is 20 that is horizontal method. So, there are 20 apples in all. Next, practice corner 6.2. Find the product using multiplication table. So, for multiplication, you have to remember the table correctly. So, revise all the table. Clear? Next, 6 into 7. So, 6 into 7, that is 42. 6 ki table is 7 time kya aega? 42. Or you can earn, read the table of 7, 6 time. That is also 42. So, you have to practice all these questions Next is multiplication fact. In multiplication, the product of number remain the same even if we change the order. Like here, 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. 
means 4 times 3, 4 into 3 that is 12. Or here we have done group of 4 3 times. So, we will write 3 into 4 that is again 12. So, in both the groups total number of 3 is 12. Thus, 4 into 3 or 3 into 4 that is 12. That means we can multiply 2 or more number in any order. The product will remain same. The product of any number and 1 is the number itself. Like 7 into 1 that is 7. The product of any number and 0 is always 0. Here 0 is added 4 times of 4 into 0 that is 0. Remember. The product of two given number is always greater than the number. The product of the given number is zada hoga unless one of the number is one or zero. Next is practice corner 6.3. Fill in the boxes to complete the multiplication fact. 4 into 7 is same as 7 into 4 that is equals to 28. Next. Multiplication of a two digit number by a one digit number without regrouping. We can multiply given two digit number by one digit number by this method. So, we have to multiply 34 by 2. Step 1. All digit number in correct place. Multiply the digit in the ones place by 2. 4 ones into 2 that is equals to 8 ones. Write 8 in 1's column. Step 2. Multiply the digit in the tens place by 2. 3 tens into 2. That is 30 into 2. 60. Means 6 tens. Write 6 in the tens column. So, 34 into 2 equals to 68. So, here we have to multiply 34 by 2. So, we will first we will multiply 2 by the number at 1's position. So, 4 into 2 that is 8. Then, we will write 2 by 3. 3 into 2 that is 6. So, product is 68. Next, practice corner 6.4. Find the product 30 multiplied by 3. So, first 3 into 0 that is 0. 3 3 is a 9. So, product is 90. Next, multiplication of 3 digit number by a 1 digit number without regrouping. So, we used 134 beads in the necklace. How many beads will she be used to make two necklaces? In one necklace, she used 134 beads. So, in two, how many beads? 134 multiplied by 2. So, first we will arrange the number in correct column. First, start with 1's. 4 into 2, that is 8. Multiply the digit at 1's place by 2. 4 into 2, that is 8 1's. Write 8 under 1's column. Step 2. Multiply the digit at 10's place by 2. 3 10's into 2, that is 60 or 6 10's. Write 6 under 10's column. Then multiply the digit at 100 place. Multiply the digit at 100 place by 2. So, 1 into 2, that is 2. So, I will write 2 under 100 column. Thus, the product is 268. So, she will use total 268 beads for two necklaces. Next, practice corner 6.5. Find the product. We have to multiply 231 by 3. So, start from 1 is 3 into 1, that is 3. 3 3 is a 9. 3 2 is a 6. So, product is 693. Next. Group activity in collaboration. Mohan found an old card in his grandfather's cupboard. It had names of his grandfather's friend and the number of the family member of each friend. The table below tells us about the family member of each friend had. Each figure stands for two members. Find the total number of family member of each friend. So, here the name of friend and these are the family member. Each figure stand for two members means one figure stand for two members. So, 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 means kitne times hai? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That is 12. Here 
टू कितने टाइम से वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट मीन्स टू इंटू एट दैट इज सिक्सटीन लाइक दिस वी फाइंड द नंबर एंड एट दैम नेक्स्ट मल्टीप्लीकेशन विथ रीग्रुपिंग मल्टीप्लाइंग अ टू डिजिट नंबर बाय अ वन डिजिट नंबर देर आर फोर्टी फाइव एग्स इन अ कार्टन हाउ मैनी एग्स आर देर इन थ्री सच कार्टन स्टेप वन मल्टीप्लाई द डिजिट इन वंस प्लेस बाय थ्री इफ द रिजल्ट इज टू डिजिट नंबर कीप द वंस एंड कैरी ओवर द टेंस फाइव इंटू थ्री दैट इज फिफ्टीन सो की फाइव इन द वंस कॉलम एंड कैरी ओवर वन टू द टेंस कॉलम Step two: Multiply the digit in the tens place by three. Add the carried over number to the result. If it is two-digit number, keep the ones and carry over the tens to the hundred column. Four into three that is twelve, and twelve plus one that is thirteen. So keep three in tens column and carry over three to the hundred column. Step three: Write the carried over digit in the hundreds column. Thus, there are one thirty-five egg in all. So first five into three that is fifteen. Write five here and one carry over. Then four into three that is twelve and add one that is thirteen. So write three here and carry over one. Then जो carry over one है उसको हम लिख देंगे hundred की position पे. So total हो जाएगा one hundred thirty five. Next, multiply a three-digit number by a one-digit number. There are two hundred thirty-five books in one rack. How many books can four such rack hold? Four का निकालना है, so we multiply two thirty-five by four. So step one क्या हो जाएगा? Multiply the digit at ones place by four. Five into four that is twenty. Write zero under ones column and carry over two to tens positions. Clear? Next time, multiply the digit at tens place by four. यानी three into four that is twelve. And two add करेंगे carry over वाला fourteen. Right? Four under tens column and carry over one. Then multiply the digit at hundred place by four. So four two is eight. Four into two eight and one carry over that is nine. So write nine under hundred column. So total books हो जाएंगे four x में nine hundred forty. Clear. Next, hearts. Who am I? If you multiply me by six, the product is more than seventeen. If you multiply me by one, the answer is less than four. So we have to find out the number. If you multiply this number by six, the product is more than seventeen. Means seventeen से ज़्यादा होना चाहिए. If you multiply me by one, the answer is less than four. Means less than four, yani one, two, three, हो सकता है. But the product is more than seventeen. So, what could be that number? Six into three, that is eighteen. So that number is three. Next. Practice corner six point six. Find the product one seventy four multiplied by five. Start from ones five four is a twenty zero two carry over seven five is a thirty five and two thirty seven. Write seven here and three carry over five ones a five plus three eight. So product is eight hundred seventy. Clear? So you have to practice all the questions. Next is word problems. One box can hold one hundred thirty-three mangoes. How many mangoes can three such bags hold? So, in one box there are one thirty-three mangoes. We have to find the number of mangoes in three such boxes. So, multiply one thirty-three by three. So, total is three hundred ninety-nine. So, three boxes can hold three hundred ninety-nine mangoes. Next is practice corner six point seven. Solve the following: Eighty-four children can sit in a bus. How many children can sit in two such bus? So in bus, one bus, bus. Eighty-four children. Two se multiply kar denge. Four to the eight, eight to the sixteen. 
सो टोटल वन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी एट स्टूडेंट कैन सेट इन टू सच बसेस क्लियर सो यू हैव टू प्रैक्टिस ऑल द क्वेश्चन विल मूव टू नेक्स्ट टॉपिक नेक्स्ट इज सोशल इमोशनल लर्निंग मल्टीप्लाई एंड राइट द आंसर हाउ मैनी डेज आर देर इन फोर वीक्स इन वन वीक देर आर सेवन डेज सो इन फोर वीक्स सेवन इंटू फोर टोटल ट्वेंटी एट डेज क्लियर नेक्स्ट इज मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चन टेक द करेक्ट ऑप्शन सो हेयर टू इज एडेड हाउ मेनी टाइम्स वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन इट इज सेम एज सेवन इंटू टू सो बी इज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन सो यू हैव टू प्रैक्टिस ऑल द क्वेश्चन ऑफ दिस चैप्टर हेयर वी एंड द चैप्टर आई होप यू अंडरस्टैंड द चैप्टर वेल नाउ यू हैव टू प्रैक्टिस इट